What's up guys, Grizzly Wizard here, welcome back to the channel. I'm watching Avatar The Last Airbender for the very first time. Uh, we just spent a lovely day at the beach, now it's on to something a little different, I think. Without further ado, let's keep going. The Avatar and the Fire Lord. Oh damn, okay. You need to know the story of your great-grandfather's demise. It will reveal your own destiny. Is this Iroh's doing? Has he snuck out of the jail already? There it is! That's Roku's home! An entire village. Hundreds of houses. All completely buried in ash. Oh wow, it's like Pompeii. I need to ask you something. What do you remember about our great-grandfather's history? Fire Lord Sozin began the war, of course. Famously waited for the comet. Later renamed Sozin's comet. Right. And used its power to launch his full-scale invasion of the world. But how did he die? Didn't you pay any attention in school, Zuko? He died peacefully, in his sleep. He was ancient. Yeah, I don't believe that. That's some state propaganda right there. He didn't die peacefully in his sleep. He was murdered by the by Fire Lord, I don't know, Zulon maybe? No, he seemed like a rather reasonable dude. He was murdered by someone, I bet. Oh, so cool. The Fire Avatar Roku rides a dragon. Of course he does. What does it mean? You're going to start a fire, dude? The Fire Sages keep the secret history. In the Dragonbone Catacombs. Dragonbone Catacombs. That sounds badass. The final testament of Fire Lord Sozin. Come, Aang. Where are we going? To visit my past. I like that Zuko and Aang are both learning this simultaneously, and I wonder what differences these two perspectives are going to give us. I remember my friend. Roku and Sozin were friends. <laughs> Looks like I win again, Roku. Are you kidding? The tree root did all the work. You were friends with Fire Lord Sozin? Back then, he was just Prince Sozin. <sighs> Say something to her. I like how we've got the Avatar theme in the background. Sozin and I shared many things, including a birthday. <laughs> Damn, Roku, this is the second time you've tripped. <laughs> it is our honor to serve you, Avatar Roku. And that changed everything. Their friendship couldn't survive the imbalance of power that came next. Here, I hope you're at least allowed to have this. But this is a royal artifact. It's supposed to be worn by the crown prince. I want you to have it. Oh. I love that that's why Roku wears that on top of his head. That's actually really moving. I was trained to master airbending, and also where I met an old friend of yours, Monk Gyatso. No way! That's Gyatso? <laughs> Check this out. Man, no wonder Gyatso was so loving to Aang. He was friends with him as Roku. And like, I already knew that, but seeing it, you know? Some friendships are so strong. They can even transcend lifetimes. Waterbending was especially challenging for me. As a, as a default firebender, sure. I mastered it as well. Nice. <laughs> the teacher's like, Ugh. A plus. My earthbending master said. Was uncompromising, stubborn, and a lifelong friend. Nice, so he's just like tough then. Uncompromising, stubborn, and blunt. It's an earth an earthbending teacher thing, I guess. He's mastering these elements and he's traveling the world, but what he's really learning is the power of friendship. Bitter work. But the results Bitter work. Nice. Were worth it. That was that episode with Ang and Toph. Yes! Oh, look at this! Oh, long years passed before I saw my friend again. Sozin, or should I say, Fire Lord? Customarily, my subjects bow before greeting me. But you're the exception. He was still my best friend. And a few months later, he was my best man. On wedding days, we look to the future with optimism and joy. What's on your mind? 
I've been thinking hard about the state of the world lately. Oh, here, here it comes. Our nation is enjoying an unprecedented time of peace and wealth. Our people are happy. We should share this prosperity with the rest of the world. Mm -hmm. Our hands is the most successful empire in history. No, the four nations are meant to be just that. Four. This is the last I want to hear about this. Unfortunately, it was many years before I learned that Sozin had gone ahead with his plan, despite my warning. Because unlike Roku, Sozin didn't travel. Sozin didn't learn to respect the other elements. How dare you occupy Earth Kingdom territory? How dare you, a citizen of the Fire Nation, address your Fire Lord this way? Don't challenge me. It will only end badly. It's over. Oh shit, that's a bad move. You may be Fire Lord, but he's the Avatar. Ugh. Avatar State! Holy shit! Oh damn! I'm sparing you, Sozin. But I warn you, even a single step out of line will result in your permanent end. Damn. And as a response, Sozin destroyed Roku's village, buried it in ash. Yep. Let's go. Sozin manipulated the volcano to erupt somehow. He must have. Oh, man. It's like Vesuvius covering Pompeii. Oh, I have chills. He's staying behind. Roku's island was a hundred miles away, but I could still feel it rumbling. I had never seen anything like this catastrophe. Wait, he didn't cause it? Was this a fucking natural disaster? I just assumed it was revenge. Holy shit. Creating lava flows, just send it into the ocean. You got smart. My success didn't last, Aang. There was no way I could do it all. Even the Avatar has limits. Get this man some eagles! Oh! Poisonous volcanic gases were overwhelming. God damn. No, dragon, get out of there! Get out of here! I'm fine! No, you're not, man. Damn. Need a hand, old friend? Sozin? There's not a moment to waste. Oh, I didn't think he'd come back. Nice, he's like channeling all the steam out. Uh, uh, Fuck no, Sozin! Don't breathe the toxic gas! Oh! He took a direct hit. Damn. Oh, man. It's so complicated. He did come back to save him, but then he left him to die. Come on, Fang. Get him out of there. Who's... Wait. That's me, isn't it? Make sense of our past, Aang. And you will bring peace and restore balance in the world. curled up and died around his friend. That's so heartbreaking. I knew the next Avatar would be born an air nomad. So I wiped out the air temples. But somehow the new Avatar eluded me. I know he's hiding out there somewhere. 
the Fire Nation's greatest threat, the last airbender. Oh, chills again. I found the secret history, which, by the way, should be renamed the history most people already know. <laughs> the note said that I needed to know about my great grandfather's death, but he was still alive in the end. No. Sozin was your father's grandfather. Your mother's grandfather was Avatar Roku. What? Evil and good are always at war in Holy you, shit. Ruko. It is your nature. What happened generations ago can be resolved now by you. Born in you, along with all the strife, is the power to restore balance to the world. It's supposed to be worn by the crown prince. Wow. Holy shit, Zuko. Their story proves anyone's capable of great good and great evil. Yes. Everyone, even the Fire Lord and the Fire Nation, have to be treated like they're worth giving a chance. Do you really think friendships can last more than one lifetime? Well, scientifically speaking, there's no way to prove that... Oh, Sokka, just hold hands. <laughs> <laughs> he won't relinquish his position, but he'll still hold hands. That was an amazing episode. Holy shit. Oh, man. My heart just breaks for the story of Roku and, Roku and Sozin. That was so sad. It really got to me that, that Fang just, like, curled up and, and chose to just die with his with his friend. Um, Zuko is related to both Roku and Sozin. That's insane. That's huge. I really... This just adds to my theory that he's gonna turn his back on, you know... The Fire Nation as a kingdom. He's going to turn his back on his dad and try and do what's right. I really hope that's where we're going with this. Get Iroh out of jail already. Why is the best character in the show languishing in a prison cell doing CrossFit? We need him in the action. Oh, man. Yeah, everyone's been telling me as I was watching book one, book two. Book three is where it's at. Book three is where it gets amazing. Um, I feel like it's been amazing the whole time, but I understand what you were saying now. These episodes are of the highest quality. And I can't wait to watch more. So thank you for watching. Um, stay tuned for more reactions. They're going to come out once per week right here on YouTube. Uh, if you don't want to wait a week, though, you can head to the Patreon page. There's a link to that in the description of the video. Uh, and you can get full-length reactions to all of the Avatar reactions. They get posted pretty much as soon as they're done up there. So if you want more content, you can check it out over there. Otherwise, I'll see you next week. Catch you in the next one. Peace!